Lakewood Cheder, when I graduated in Lakewood Cheder, we had five boys in the class. In eighth grade, it started off with much more. In Lakewood, at that time, people did not stay like today. And as people got jobs or got stellars, they went on, and the, and the class kept on getting smaller and smaller. So by the time we graduated, we were left with, uh, with only five. We graduated, we were in the Legion building. We started off in the Yeshiva dining room. In the Yeshiva dining room, we went to the Mikvah building, had an extra room there, and from there we went to the Legion building. Across the street was the girls' school, and it was called the Sharky building. In those days in Lakewood, everybody knew everybody. Boys were in the Legion building, and the Yeshiva was another hundred feet away, so it was all one big happy family. The Hatzlacha for the Cheder and the way the Cheder was started and that was the basis of the Cheder was the involvement of the parents, that the parents were most efforts to get the school started and to keep the school going. And without that it's not going to work. The parents felt it was their school. And the parents today have to have the same feeling, feeling that it's their school and they want it to succeed. And do everything in their powers with work, financially, to ensure the success and the viability of the school. My wife and I accepted the award, seeing that the Moisib was at a very critical juncture. The Cheder is in totally unacceptable living conditions, and I don't think anybody is going to disagree that we need to move into a new building. And it's only going to happen if the parents are going to help and get involved and push it, to be relentless about it, push the board, pressure the board, pressure anybody in their power to make sure that we move on and to bring the children in, into a situation that's recovered for the Lakewood Cheder.